morning guys it's 6 50 a.m monday january the 4th so it's the first day back to school i'm actually surprised that i was able to get up this early because i've been sleeping in every day over the break but here we are so i'm just gonna get changed and do a quick workout make breakfast and coffee and i'll be back Next up on my agenda is an indigenous cultural safety module. So I have two hours allocated for this module. I just finished the indigenous cultural safety module and it took longer than the allocated time of two hours because I was taking some in-depth notes. I'm really interested and passionate about this topic and I wanted to remember the details and as I learned more, I wanted to synthesize uh, the knowledge and have my own thoughts and ideas. So I wrote down some key points. I'll actually show you guys in a minute what the note, what my notes look like and there are some videos, um, documentaries that I want to watch to learn more, some articles so I made a list of um, action items for further learning and I also got to do a bit of reflections kind of connecting my uh, previous knowledge and my own personal experience with what I learned in this module so here's what my notes look like um, some of the topics that this module dealt with were oral histories and stories, colonial policies and aboriginal rights, um, colonial histories and aboriginal health governance. And here's the section of resources, things that I want to look into more, um, my own reflections, and action item. So I want to read more personal memoir, a personal account of stories about life in residential schools and going through 60s scoop. The next thing on my agenda is to do a introduction to central nervous system neuroanatomy module. Um, that's half an hour and I have two of them so I'm gonna try to finish those and maybe have lunch before the afternoon's synchronous um, interprofessional discussion Native session. 86 billion neurons in the brain, each of which forms an average of 7,000 connections with other neurons, resulting in between
Here is my lunch. So I have the leftover chickens from last night. I just made the salad and this super healthy rice that I made a couple of days ago. I just microwaved the chicken and the rice and put the salad. It's 3.15 p.m. and we just finished our respectful learning environment workshop. It was a interprofessional session, so in a group we had a facilitator, we had some med students, dental students, and OT and PT students, and we just talked about uh, various scenarios where there were issues regarding professionalism, respect, um, inappropriate and appropriate behaviors. We had some really interesting discussions around these scenarios and it was really nice hearing everyone's thoughts. So some of the key takeaways that I personally took were the importance of um, creating a safe space and being respectful, maintaining professional boundaries, owning up to your mistake if you've made one, apologizing, learning from your mistakes so that you do better next time. One of the other key points that came up was just the importance of staying woke, um, being aware of what's going on in the world, and self-awareness and self-reflection are very important too. I just finished the debrief with the whole class and it's currently 4 p.m. I still have a video and a module to do, but I think I'm gonna go for a run first, come back and do those things. I just got back from my run. I got rained on a little, but honestly, it's so refreshing and it feels so nice. I'm trying to decide what to eat for dinner tonight. So I'm going to my healthy eating tab on my Notion and I have these recipes saved here. And I think this one is just calling my name. Easy Mediterranean shrimp recipe. So I actually um, took this recipe into account when I went grocery shopping a couple of days ago and I have most of these ingredients. Maybe I'll watch a lecture and then it'll be around 6 and I'll start making dinner. the Mediterranean shrimp dish but then I remembered I still have the mushroom stir fry from the other night so I'm gonna finish that first maybe cook some mackerel and have those with rice and that'll be my dinner For the air fryer to be done, I'm going to finish the lecture for today and this one is half an hour long so I'll be done just in time for dinner.
gonna take the vitamins now. I'm taking vitamin C and D. It's currently 9 p.m. and I ended up taking a break for two hours. I edited a video and published it just now. It's the new apartment tour video, so if you haven't already, please go check that out. And I FaceTimed one of my friends and had a really nice chat. Now I'm gonna go take a shower, get changed, watch the rest of the lecture. I was hoping to do some reviewing, but I think I'm gonna do that tomorrow. But instead, um, after finishing the lecture, I'm gonna go to bed and maybe read some. Open one or two textbooks and find very gentle.